So, <laughs> Jesus, look at that. Oh, it's 9.18. Oh, fuck it. 9.18. Um, Wednesday, 10th, May 9, uh, 2017. This one looks like I got something in my mouth. Like, Jesus. It's actually, it was, it's actually better today. Yesterday it was so much worse. Face looks fucked. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> there's this thing on the side, like, what is that? It should be like this. That, that, what's this? It looks all maligned. It looks all maligned. Uh, oh, Jesus. And it's all messed up. Oh, God. I go to the. Stupid job agency thing. <sighs> huh? Oh, these are two hard disks. <laughs> this will be on the computer. <laughs> oh my god. Well, this is the best I could do. Uh, it doesn't hurt or anything. Oh, there's all this. Pus and everything coming out. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, it's like it must be all the um, white blood cells, dead white blood cells or something. I don't know if I could put makeup on top of this. Maybe I should leave this part and just put it on the side. Um, definitely over here it's all ugh. I got this sticky thing leaking out. Oh, God. That's why it's so swollen, maybe. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so bad. It's like a... Oh, it's so bad. It's like a... Well, hopefully, next week I'll tell him to work on the... I'll tell her to work on the bottom over here. And you know, it's gonna take like a, it's gonna take a while. <coughs> oh, Is this the new one or the old one? I don't know. I'm the old one. Let's throw these things away. It's like everything is just. Uh, <coughs> Prostitution. <laughs> Bad lighting. Uh, let me see if I put the uh, <coughs> the other uh, thing over here. Ah, I'm my. Yes, I can testify to the fact that electrolysis it can be quite painful, extremely painful. Mm. I'm funding my electrolysis by borrowing money from my brother. Usually I pay like $450 every fortnight. Um, for my living expenses and rent and everything. But um, I'm using that money to do this electrolysis thing. I owe my brother lots of money. Lots of people, uh, like in my family, owe him money. <laughs> he's like the, he's the only financially responsible person in our family. I don't know, my dad is financially, you know, but um, Definitely, my brother, ever since he was young, he's been like that. He's, uh, he's, he's always been like, uh, you know, he doesn't like spending money. And where did he get that? Like, when he was uh, like a, uh, he was a very young teenager. He was very young. He was, he, he was like that. It's like, I don't know where he got it from. It's not like he got it from me or anyone. 
<laughs> he got it from who did he get it from that's his personality his personality is like that it's like you live in the same family but people different people they will have different personalities and um temperaments <laughs> oh, that, uh, yeah. so he's a video <sighs> I do get rent assistance, and uh, you know my name is on the rental agreement, so um, technically I should be paying. Well, I am kind of paying my rent because I do owe the money. You know, so it does feel kind of weird because if I'm getting rent assistance, you're not be paying rent. But I pay more than rent. Uh, well, technically I should be paying rent, but. Um, at the moment, I'm using that money to fund my electrolysis. Uh, you know, which seems kind of ethically problematic to me. I feel disturbed by that. Cause I get rent assistance like eighty eighty dollars a fortnight uh, for my rent uh, assistance. <clears throat> so, um, I should at least be paying eighty dollars a month, <laughs> but uh, I'm justifying it to myself because I used to pay all the time four hundred fifty dollars. So doesn't that all add up? <laughs> but still, I don't know. I just, I mean, uh, I would, be, you know, I should, I should pay my. Uh, my share of the living expenses like every fortnight my share is four hundred and fifty dollars so that's like two hundred and twenty five dollars a week is what I pay to live in this house and eat my eat the food and share the amenities with the electricity the internet uh, that's how much I pay I really don't look less. I was paying that money consistently for the first few years, but it just like last year, at the end of last year, sometime every few months, like <clears throat> I haven't been paying last, the, like the last few months of last year and the few months of this year, I haven't been <clears throat> paying my share of the living expenses. Uh, I feel kind of disturbed right now. I feel I feel bad about that. Am I gonna to go to jail? <laughs> Is this settling gonna come and say, You cheat! You're taking rent assistance and you're not paying rent? We're gonna we're gonna put you in jail. But my name is on the rental agreement. My name is on the rental agreement. And I'm borrowing money from my brother, which I intend to pay back. Isn't that, isn't that okay? Does that seem okay to you? Does it seem okay to you? All right, it doesn't seem okay to me. I personally, I would not, I don't. I'm not comfortable doing this. But I'm not sure if it's exactly illegal because <clears throat> my name is on the rental agreement, so it's not like I'm not supposed to pay rent. I am supposed to. Um, I mean, it's like... On our rental agreement, there's me, my mom, and my brother. Are all, all of our names are on the rental agreement. So, we three are responsible. We, we three are tenants in this property. Um, so... Yeah, but you know, I don't feel too happy. But I want to get this electrolysis done, you know. I want to get this done, and you know, I guess you know, you know, some people. I mean, it's still not a good excuse. You don't have money, you can't do electrolysis. You don't have money, you cannot do electrolysis. I don't care what your situation is. <coughs>
They're gonna they're gonna strike me off the roll roll of lawyers. You failed to pay your share of the rent. Your forty dollars a week for that. You shall be struck off the roll. And therein goes your chance at making a living as as a lawyer or something. Oh, oh look. So I am thinking about that. I am thinking about that. <laughs> um, See, all this white color pus type thing comes out. It's like sticky. Ugh. Yuck. It's dead. White cells. Or dead something. Why is this all swollen? Oh, okay. Um. That's good enough. Mm -hmm. The thing is like... <clears throat> hmm, maybe I should at least pay $50 to my brother. Oh, not fifty, uh, hundred. Cause I'll take care of the rent. At least that part. Yeah, I feel I will feel better. Um, I can use the remainder of the money to do the electrolysis. So, yeah, you know, maybe I'll, I'll do that. It's good I had this conversation. So uh, because I have to pay rent like forty dollars a week. So if I give hundred dollars a fortnight, that'll cover the rent. So. Uh, yes, that that's better. Um, and for the parts, for the for the weeks I didn't pay the rent. Well, you know. Um, before that, I used to pay four and fifty dollars. So <laughs> anyway, so uh, going forward, I think I will pay at uh, uh, out of my out of my fortnight. I get like six thirty out of the fortnight, so I will pay one hundred dollars at the very least. The other three hundred and fifty dollars goes to my living expenses. But I'll I'll use that money for now, borrowed, to pay for my electrolysis. But I will I will pay at least one hundred dollars a fortnight. That should that'll at least uh you know then you know, I'm paying my rent, you know. Like, no, I, I give it to my brother, he pays the rent. And, um, that seems that seems right. <laughs> so it's good I had this conversation. Uh, yes, it's, uh, yes. Why didn't I think of that earlier? I was like, what the fuck? I should have done it earlier. I'm like, um, I feel so guilty right now. Like, How could you? How could you take rent assistance? You haven't paid rent for a few months. How could you do that? You cheat, you lie. You do that. Um, Anyway, uh, yes. um, so I gotta go and, uh, I gotta go, um, well, you know, my video's up here, I'm very paranoid, I'm very paranoid, and if anyone wants to, you report me to the authorities or to the legal profession or the center, like, you're free to do so, and they can audit me, or something, or they can, I don't know, do a check on me, and I will show them what I'm doing, uh, yeah, I will show them, and if I need to pay back money, I will pay back money, uh, okay, so, yeah, but I don't think, personally, uh, ethically, I, sh I feel like I should be paying the $100 at the very least, so I will do that, but, um, I'm not sure if, I'm legally doing anything wrong because my my name is still on the rental agreement. Uh, so it's like my brother pays the rent anyway. I mean, he pays the rent. He, whether I pay him or not, he pays the rent. But it is my responsibility to pay him the rent plus the living expenses. And so that I haven't done recently. 
uh, for a few months this year and last year, you know, four or five months, so it was a long time. So, yeah. I can actually check how much I owe him. <laughs> I think I probably owe him thousands of dollars, so. Yeah, I owe him a lot of money. Anyway, so, <coughs> I gotta go. Uh, I gotta go to this job thing and, uh, <laughs> Will I be okay? Will they find me out? Will they say, what the fuck is wrong with you? What the fuck happened to your face? And I have to tell them, uh, <laughs> what do I tell them? Domestic violence? Oh, no. Uh, I think, I think, I think it's up to me to decide how I, uh, I mean, I get rent assist and I have, there is a reason why I get rent assistance. The reason I get rent assistance is because I am a tenant in this property and I need to pay rent to Livia. Uh, so it is my responsibility to pay my rent. Mm. My rent is actually like $120, but the rent assistance I receive is $80. Yeah, so I... So... You know what, I will, I will pay my share of the rent. Instead of 100 I will pay... I think it's 40 divided by 3. Oh, I have to pay 140... 146. So I'll pay 150. Oh, Jesus. Is that for a week? What the fuck? The rent for this property is like 230, 293, 150, 146 a week, and they only give me like $40 for the rent assistance. All right, I'll pay whatever the Centrelink gives me for the rent assistance. I'll, I'll pay hundred dollars. I'll pay the money Centrelink gives me, and the remainder, which is my responsibility, I'm borrowing it from my brother. <sighs> because we pay four hundred forty dollars a week. You divide that by three, it's like the Centrelink gives me like forty dollars rent assistance a week. Forty-two or something. Anyway, I gotta go now. Oh, look. <coughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is so fucked up, man. Look at all this pus thing coming out. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I need, I need like a... <laughs> I don't think I should be going on. Look, look. Maybe I'll just go and show her my face and tell her. Look, I can't breathe. I want to cause infection. You know, all this blood, I was like wondering. <clears throat> so, can I get diseases like because of this thing? Like, you know, dangerous diseases. So, I mean, anyway, this is just me being paranoid. Uh. So it's like <clears throat> um, what is I saying? Uh, maybe mom's very stressed because she has to do all these things, and uh, what did I 
thinking, oh yeah, pus leaking out of the... <laughs> oh, look at this, man. What the fuck is this? Look at it. It's like... Uh, look at the, my lips. It's like, it's like bleeding or something. Like... You know, it's all, all fucked up. Look at it. It's like... This is like hot. Like something like that. Look at Yeah. Swallow. So if people ask, what do I say? Uh, it's a disease. <laughs> Contagious. <laughs> Stay away from me. <laughs> You'll get it. <laughs> that would keep people away. But uh, I think I might get a blood test, like for any. I'm just being paranoid. I was thinking, holy shit! Oh, look at all this blood shit coming out. So, what if I get infected with some horrible disease? <laughs> no, they, 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 I'm not saying anything bad about the place. That they're fine. They whatever. This is. <clears throat> I'm a paranoid person, right? And uh, Jesus. So anyway, so I was thinking. <gasps> Oh shit, maybe I should get myself tested. What if I contracted something? <laughs> shit, I'm gonna get sued now. On top of the rent assistance thing, I'm gonna get sued. How dare you speak bad about us? How dare you? We're gonna sue you, sue you for defamation. And we're gonna... I tell people where I get my electrons. <laughs> this is not, I'm not saying anything ill of the people. They're doing a fantastic job. They're doing a fantastic job. Oh, they're doing a fantastic job. But I'm a paranoid person and I have a right. <laughs> this version. I'm gonna keep up and shut my mouth before I dig myself into a hole here. So, just finished the thing, hour 11. They're going all hardcore. They're going all strict. You have to do this, you have to do that. Um, She looked at my face and <laughs> she, 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 uh, I was just sitting there and then she goes, oh, oh Yvette, uh, could you go and do the job search or something? And I came up and I handed her the papers and then she looked at my face and goes, oh, if you're not well, we can, <laughs> we can see you tomorrow. <laughs> Good face. I'm okay, it's just that my face is a bit messed up. <laughs> anyway, gotta go home now. <laughs>